All right, what's up, guys? We're back here on Black Ops Cold War Zombies. And as you may notice, we are in a little bit of a different setup here. I am away from home. So I have my mobile setup. I have, it's it's really, really weird. If you want to see it, I'll put a picture up on screen. I also put this up on my Twitter and my Instagram. If you want to follow me over there, I'm most active on Twitter. But I have a really, really weird mobile setup right now. I'm working with what I got. So uh, hopefully it, it still works for you guys. I even have this microphone here on its side. It's a little bit of a different microphone that I'm used to using. So I'm going to try to keep my my mic etiquette for you guys just the audio quality is all right but uh there might be a little hiccups here and there so i apologize in advance but last time we were here getting a weapon dark aether on zombies it was the wakasashi so i figured why not start out this whole mobile recording fiasco by trying to get the sledgehammer dark aether now this is a complete step back from the wakasashi it is nowhere near as fast it has a weird lunge to it the it's just all around gonna be an awful time <laughs> but to make matters even worse i'm gonna be playing on a controller now this is no diss to controller players but i am just personally not good with one i mainly play keyboard and mouse we, i i gotta figure out this audio setup before i try you know clicking around on my mouse and and keyboard otherwise the you know the whole thing will be scuffed but for today we're gonna be trying to get as many camos as possible for the sledgehammer here i don't think we're gonna be able to get it in one game mainly because it's my first time really playing zombies on a controller in a while but i'm gonna try to show you me struggling with this thing and we by the end of this video this will be dark eight but that's enough talking. Let's go ahead and hop into Mauer Day Toten. All right, here we go. This is basically my first game of zombies on this laptop. I played a few test games here and there just to make sure that it could record. But this is the first game of zombies I've played in about a week now. Uh, I've had a few videos pre-recorded. I still have a few more that might come out, some more zone stuff. Hopefully, I'm not that rusty. Uh, hopefully, we can figure out how to play zombies here on a controller. Okay, all right, we got loose change, we're getting there. So far, this thing's doing really well. It is only round two, but not, not bad for round two. We're just bopping heads. It's actually kind of fun so far. I'm gonna regret saying that, but right now it's pretty fun. But so far, so good. I mean, it's a round three, no downs yet. I mean, that it really shouldn't be accomplishment, but for me playing on controller, being as awful on the sticks as I am, this I should be getting a medal for this. <laughs> I have a feeling once we hit like round 15, it's gonna be all out, just pandemonium of me going down or trying to escape zombies. So I have no idea how I'm gonna train like this, but I think I need to prioritize getting armor. That frenzy guard is gonna save my life. Now our first task, can we kill a tempest? Where are they at? There's our man. Oh no. Ooh, that was rough, and that was just one tempest. I don't even want to attempt to try to figure out ladders on on a controller. I'm going down, and I'm yelling timber. All right, let's beat the train. Go across, go across, go across. Oh, we made it. We'll grab our loose change as our reward. Oh, I don't have enough money to get through here. All right, bring it on. Can I inspect? Oh, let's go. Ooh, check it out. Do a little sign flip with it. We got cash for gold, baby. Bring it here. Carpenter, perfect, perfect. Just what we need. We're playing a dangerous game out in these tracks. That's why I'm leaving. Tempest want to spawn in here? Nope. Bro, why is every door 1500? I'm so broke. And I'm in the dark. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ooh. Cracking skulls this is actually pretty sick. This is, this is by no means an E-Tool or a Wakasashi, but this thing is still very satisfying to use. Oh, max ammo. Perfect. I was getting worried. Let's grab this loose change. Turn the power on. And let's go ahead and throw our first fuse in. Now, I would open this door and go ahead and get the next Tempest, but I've seen enough Samuel the 17th to know not to open that door if I want to get to a high round. But my prediction is <laughs> I think I'm going to be dead by round 25. I'm not going to lie. I am not confident confident in my ability on the sticks. Ooh, but we get our first camo there. Oh, we don't have any money, so heads are about to get cracked open. Okay, now we have enough. Open it. Tempest, where you at? Come get some. One more. Good night. And we got the growl camo. Let's go. Ooh, and another camo. We're racking these up. Maybe we can do this. <laughs> but using this controller after like not playing on a controller for years and years especially in zombies it is like learning how to walk again see i can't even face this thing the right way can i put this in please did i not oh i killed the tempest and didn't pick up the fuse is it still there what happens if you do that what what happens now i don't i've never i've never not picked up the fuse am i screwed oh no it's still here Jeez, this is just a testament to how little i play controller all right now we can do one of these one of those and we are all set go to bed oh wait you have a friend he can also go to bed we might as well just get the disciple step out of the way 
I forgot about controller vibration. My shit's going crazy right now. Oh, you come here. There we go. There we go. Get some. All right, all y'all go to bed. All right, now this is the part that's going to be a little difficult. Can I upgrade this? Okay, I can. Perfect. I really should have bought armor, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. This really doesn't need an upgrade, at least not yet. But without armor, Frenzy Guard is kind of useless. All right, let's try to let's try to open up these little these little holes here, our little origins holes, like they call them, and see if we can get a little extra salvage here so we can buy some armor. All right, spotlight go away. Let's go ahead, grab armor tier one, and now we can finally use our field upgrade. Let's see what it's like. Use this. Now that everyone's walking, no Christopher, we can go ahead and slam through these guys. Oh, the swing time is definitely way slower. I have to time these perfectly. I can't sit there and spam it, but it's still one shot at this point. That's all you can really ask for. All right, let's go ahead and pack a punch it. Now this is what it looks like pack a punched. It looks actually really, really good. There's plenty of space for this red, that's accent color. It makes, it makes the handle look really nice. And the actual top part of the sledgehammer here has the second part of the pack a punch camo, the, the little act reactive not reactive but moving camo i don't know i'm not a linguist but it looks pretty nice what ammo mod do people put on melee weapons is it shatter blast is that the meta now or is it still brain rot either way i need to get up here and sit by wonder fizz this is going to be the best way for me to get melee kills at least at these early rounds go ahead and climb up go on oh you got a friend coming through here sleep who's next get out of here goodbye see you later send a postcard I'm running out of things to say. Get off me. And we're getting camos? Let's go. This spot's cheese. This is the, the mozzarella spots. I'm starting to panic though. <laughs> okay. All right. We're, we're living. We're living. Cracked his skull. Oh, we already have 127 kills with this thing? Oh, 25. Jeez, I really can't read. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. They're a lot faster. They're a lot faster. We, do we really need a stun? We actually have to stun on round eight. This is not good. Oh, this thing needs faster swing speed yesterday. <laughs> we had to zip line out at round eight. This is ridiculous. Maybe maybe we'll get an ammo mod. Maybe that'll help. Should I get dead wire? Oh, this is tough. Okay, I don't think dead wire will take away for our kills, but I know brain rot will. Dead wire just might save our life at some point, so I'll stick with that. I, maybe maybe I sit back in the grind spot. Maybe this will be good. We'll try this out. Okay. We're getting camos still. We're getting camos. Good thing is we only need 750 kills and we're already at like one. What is it? Oh, 169. Shout out to sex. Don't shout out that nuke though. All right, here here he comes. I'm not scared at all. Not in the slightest. Cause I got frenzy guard, baby. Yeah, hit me. What? Why did it switch my fist? I'm not that confident. No, stop hitting me. Knock that off. Here, have a molly actually. I missed, hold on. All right, there we go. Just as I planned. I, I, I don't know if all melee weapons have the same damage output, but I really think a sledgehammer should have like splash damage because of its slow swing speed. If there was a way to balance this, I think that would be it. Oh, Disciple. Ooh, he got one clapped. What the, what is one clap? I don't know what I'm on. Dance for me, dance for me, dance for me. All right, well, we do have 21,000 points. Let's go ahead and get Pack-A-Punch 2. Ooh, this looks actually really good. You can see the, the pattern real nice there on the handle. The top part looking nice. You can, ooh, you actually see the pattern up close right there. I like that. Let's do one of these, Frenzy Guard. Let's hit this Panzer while we're in Frenzy Guard and it just ended, I think. Oh no, we're still in it. Gone. We actually handled that pretty well and we got a calling card out of it. Okay, this right now, we're not handling well. Oh no. Stun. Oh, another stun. How am I still up? Run, run away, run away. Oh, you know what? I completely forgot about jackrabbit kills. So that that means I need to get 20 kills without getting hit. Why am I remembering this on round 20? Oh, well, hopefully we got a decent amount knocked out because it's, it's only harder from this point on. All right, let's try to get it here. That's already two without getting hit. And we're back to zero. God, I really need to focus on these. We might have to just go back into another game and get it done. He's camping over the car. How, how am I supposed to hit that? Get down here. Oh, I hate this guy. Hold on. Oh, I can climb up here too? What's up? <laughs> get out of here. Shatter Blast might be a good way to get it, actually. Maybe we should grab that. Yeah, we're, we're gonna go ahead and change our ammo mod to Shatter Blast. I think that's gonna help out a lot. Oh, we got 30k. Let's get this triple packed. Oh, I really like this. The all gold handle. Perfect, and the top looking nice. Pack a punch three looks really good on melee weapons. Okay, all right, we're getting a little progress here. I just really have to keep my distance. Oh, and then not pay attention and get hit from the side. Perfect. Okay, all right, rotten camo is done. We officially have all the kills that we need. That means we're probably pretty close on our pack a punch too. I just gotta keep my distance here. Ooh, shatter blast is so clutch. 
So clutch. That's ridiculous. Oh, that's a jackrabbit medal. Perfect. Is the corrosion the last one? We got to be close. Maybe it's 25 times. And I think I know how we can get it done, actually. So I've noticed, and some of you guys have probably noticed this, your first hit of the round will be your elemental hit, like your ammo mod effect. So next round, when we get some zombies in, I'm going to train them up. I'm going to try to hit one of them. We have elemental pop, so it could be any ammo mod that happens, but we have a double the amount of chance for it to be shatter blast since we have that equipped. So my plan here is to get as big as a train as I can and then try to shatter blast that. And that should be at least 20 kills towards a jackrabbit metal. But we have surpassed my goal of 25 we we've made it this far but good news is is that we're getting we're getting there on our camos i think we might we should be able to get this dark aether actually and that's gonna be pretty impressive or at least i'm impressing myself that i can do a sledgehammer on a controller and i literally without even finishing that breath already screwed up my plan so i, I retract me saying that i'm proud of myself oh okay we're done with pack a punch camos what else do we need i feel like it is jack rabbit kills and i i definitely think it's jack rabbit kills and the kills while while the enemies are stunned is there any stuns or anything really on the ground they have not been dropping them for me all right this time i will not hit a zombie until i have a big train going i i really have to force myself that's it i'm pulling out fists just so in case I forget within the next three seconds, which is very possible. I, I will not hit a zombie till I got a good train. Oh, this mango is going to be an issue. I am honestly, I, I astound myself with how dumb I am. I'm like, oh, this mango is going to be a problem with training. Let me go ahead and take him out. And then I instantly get rid of my shatter blast. You, you, you guys know what happened. We all know what happened here. <laughs> Can we get another shatter blast? Can they bless us? Is this a decoy? It is. Okay, that should be it. There we go. 30? Is that it? That should be done, right? If not, very close to it. Because I thought that camo went up to 25 and that one just said 30. So I'm not sure of anything anymore. There we go. That's a nice shatter blast. That's a jackrabbit metal. That's all we need. We just need shatter blast to proc. See, our plan works in theory, but I don't have the brain capacity to get it done constantly. So we just have to rely on RNG. Okay, this seems like a nice, decent group. Oh yeah. We didn't get jackrabbit there though because we got hit in the middle of it. I just got to time that swing better. Oh, that way, there we go. We just need one more hit. Throw another one. We're getting everything done in this run. Throw a stun. There we go. All right, we, we need a few more. We need a few more. There we go. We made it to 50. We'll hit the nuke just in case. And we got a jackrabbit medal out of it. We got to be really close here. Pulling out all the stops. All right, we got a pretty nice train. Let's hit it. Ooh, there we go. Easy jackrabbit. No gold viper yet, though. So I got to try to keep stunning, but I need to wait till another one drops. I think we might be done with stuns. I don't know if we really need to focus on those anymore, but I'll, I'll keep doing them every once in a while here because they also help get jackrabbit kills. We made it to round 30. I'm blowing my own expectations out of the water here, but hopefully we're not missing anything super important. Oh, I literally, I throw the strat out the window. I have to start the round every time. It like doesn't exist anymore at this point, honestly. Oh no. Throw the stun. Oh, throw the Semtex. I think I'm dead here. <gasps> How did I survive? Let's go. Today on I Shouldn't Be Alive. Dude, stuns are overpowered. They're so overpowered. Stuns and Semtex, broken combo. Oh, perfect. We got a Panzer coming in too. Where's that bad boy at? Where's that thick mommy? There he is. That's our guy. Now let's get a nice train going. Right here. Not bad. Hit the frenzied guard. Oh, he is just tanking damage. Oh, he's playing no games. I'm going down. I'm getting out of here. Oh, mangler, mangler. Come on, die for me, please. All right, we're going up. <gasps> what? I have never seen that before in my life. I used the repel while being down. Oh, that's not enough. Oh, let's, let's revive here. We've gone down a few times now. Oh, I think that's it. Oh, no. We got right back up. Now this is it. I, I'm kind of okay with dying here. I want to see... Yeah, all right. I'm fine with that. I want to see what camos we still need to complete. Because for whatever reason, whenever we do melee weapons, I can never remember the exact challenges, but I'm sure we're close. We got a lot of levels there. A lot of camos. Oh, we can't even scroll through them. That's how many we got. What are we missing on this? It's got to be Jackrabbit, right? Three kills with the sledgehammer while you have 
Frost Blast, Ring of Fire, or Aether Shroud active. And then it's, oh, then it's the Jackrabbit. Okay. All right, I guess we still have a bit of work to do. All right, here we go, game two. Just need to get some Jackrabbits and get some kills while in Aether Shroud. We have switched out Forensic Guard to Aether Shroud. These melee weapons to get Dark Aether would be so much easier if I actually read the challenges before doing them. And this is like twice in a row that I haven't done it. Just to make things easier for myself for these jackrabbit kills, I'm just going to come and stand right here. I've actually devolved down to the point where on round three, I need to stand up here to get jackrabbit kills. Come on up, young man. Can I hit you from here? Nope. There we go. It's weird. The way this thing swings, I feel like I should be hitting them. Like, especially right there. There we go. That's two. We got to be close to this jackrabbit metal. There we go. This is such a cheese spot early round. Come on up. Go ahead. Bonk. 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 All right, let's take the shroud. Oh, there we go. Climb back up. There's a Funkadelic camo. One of the best looking camos in this game. I'm really trying to get this done without having to turn power on. I think it's only going to start to get tougher, but I think melee weapons are actually buffed a bit, so they're going to be one shot for a while. Okay, they're getting a little faster getting up here. We're surviving though. Okay, now we need to dip. Drop down, hop back up. Ooh. Ooh, we're, we're dicing them up now. Come on up. I won't bite. Might just swing a hammer at you, though. All right, might as well just go turn power on now. Where's our Tempest, pal? Oh, there is no Tempest, pal. It's round 10 and we have a Panzer. Okay, uh, completely forgot about Panzer rounds. Oh, no. Okay, I need to use this. I'm so hurt. The rope's not even here yet. This is, this is tough down here. Especially with this panzer. No. Oh, I'm already down. All right, everybody vacate the premises. Oh, I screwed myself being over here. Oh, okay, we got Aether Shroud. Let's do it. Oh, those swings are doing nothing. Oh, we got Gold Viper, though. We did it. Run. Okay, maybe we can try to exfil. If we can survive this, we'll exfil. Wait, can we, can we even exfil without power? All right, come here, Tempest. There we go. Pick it up. Oh my God, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's get around these guys. Grab the armor, grab the fuse. Let's open the door. <laughs> this is terrifying. I waited way too long to get this done. All right, there's a fuse. Now I need to go up and get the other Tempest. I don't think I've ever seen the Tempest spawn in here. We got both fuses now though. Let's go ahead and turn power on. There we go. Throw on the lever. Let's grab elemental pop. Maybe that'll help keep us alive. Let's try to get Pack-a-Punch on too. Come here, Disciple. It's between me and you, pal. One more. There we go. Let's pack a punch it. Let's get Shatter Blast on it. All right, now let's clear out this round and then we can exfil. I think that Panzer's still roaming around here unless something else took it out. Okay, no, exfil's open. We can get this. I don't know where that Panzer went. Maybe it despawned. Oh, it died right over here. I didn't even know how it died. Let's start the exfil. There we go. All right, I have no self revive. I have one decoy, no quick revive. I get one chance at this. I cannot go down at all. All right, we made it up. First, let's start with a decoy. Maybe we can Shatter Blast them. We can, let's go. Perfect. All right, now we Aether Shroud. Get as many as we can. I say that and I lose them all. Get them, Brain Rot. Oh, another Shatter Blast, perfect. Only nine zombies left. And I went down, no. All right, well, I guess all that matters is that we got this Dark Aether. Let's go ahead and see what it looks like with all the mastery camos and we'll hop in game and show what the skin looks like. All right, here is it with Golden Viper. Still, my opinion stays the same on Gold Viper. Not that great. Plague Diamond though, that looks amazing. I don't, the texture's not really loading on the top of the hammer. There it is. But the whole top of the hammer's iced out. The, the, the handles, all that nice purple, it's very good. And then Dark Aether looks really nice. The entire top of the hammer there is all the Dark Aether pattern. It's a nice big area to show off the whole camo see all the movement on it see all the colors very nice now let's go ahead and hop in game and see what it looks like there all right so it looks like they added a, a map collateral it sounds familiar i don't know if it's been in any previous cod games but here we are on collateral and this is what it looks like in game with dark aether i think it looks really really nice these weapons where they have a lot of space to show the camo off are so so nice like i appreciate how much better the camera coverage has gotten on these dlc weapons now let's find a spot not in the smoke to check it out right here seems pretty good all right let's take a peek at it in the sun that's nice that's really good. Anyways, the sledgehammer wasn't that bad of a grind. I definitely could have gotten it within the first game had I paid attention to the challenges. Uh, next time we do a melee weapon, I'll for sure keep that in mind. It, it's going to take a few. Uh, you, you saw me go for the jackrabbit kills and how much I literally forgot the second I was doing it, you know, to get shatter blast. But overall, 
uh fun grind definitely not the best weapon for zombies uh, not even near the best weapon probably very very bottom tier but overall pretty good weapon pretty good looking weapon right now it's giving us the nice colors on the dark aether but i think that's where i'm gonna end this video if you guys like this and you want to see more leave a like on it uh if you think you don't dislike if you're new here please consider subscribing put out all kinds of cod content throughout the week but that's gonna be it for me i'll see you guys next time later